Hi Libra, welcome to your weekly reading for May 17th to the 23rd, 2019. All right, let's see what you guys are doing this week. So first of all, you have the Ace of Cups in reverse in your what? So that means you're gonna change your mind about something. It could be about, um, this is also about being gullible, like one-sided love, unrequited love, that type of thing. And then in the how, you have the Seven of Swords in the upright. This is called hope. This is about waiting for news, waiting for something to change. This is also about delivery, deliberately changing something. Um, actually, this is about deliberately changing your viewpoint. Also about taking a risk to get out of a boring situation. Someone not caring about the consequences. Running away. Also, um, this can be about deception and hidden dishonor. In the why, you have the hermit in the reverse. This is called the traitor. This is, a, in the reverse, this is about someone revealing themselves, like coming clean, like a backstabber. Um, I'm not sure it means someone intentionally outing themselves. I think it's more like accidentally outing themselves, but they're outing themselves. Something that's caused a lot of emotional distress to others. Um, it's also about lots of work for nothing. It's definitely a warning card about um, be careful who and what you invest in. He's looking at this deliberately changing um, someone's viewpoint. I think this person maybe Maybe somebody changed your mind deliberately, or maybe somebody um, manipulated you and you changed your mind, or you were gullible to it and then you changed your mind, or it could go either way. All right, let's keep going. Um, in the just, or sorry, in the um, how you're gonna feel, you have the justice in reverse. This is, a, this is being treated unfairly. You feel like you've been tricked. You feel like you've been betrayed. You might feel like you've been singled out. You could even feel blamed. You could be stuck in a legal trap. Definitely not feeling happy, out of balance, which is really not good for Libra because you are, that's your sign. So this is not a good, that's not a good look for Libra. And then in the advice, you have the marriage card in the upright. So this can be about a marriage. This can be about a relationship. It can be about a family. It could be about, um, this can mean someone's having a baby. But this is also about making an important decision. It can be about a contract, a union, taking an oath or something that is bound by oath. And then in the bottom of the deck, you have Eight of Wands in the upright. That is house party. Traveling with friends, socializing, communicating, messages, not sure if they're to you or from you, enthusiasm, taking action, getting news or spreading news. Okay, so let me just, oh, I'm gonna, the bottom of this card where it's meeting the marriage card is getting advice, consulting an expert. It can also mean turning the tables. And then where these are meeting, this is, this end of this card is called the hypocrite. Again, it's betrayal. Discovering disloyal friends um, or family, coworkers, people just in your life. Hopefully not more than one. <laughs> um, so it looks like someone has intentionally tried to manipulate your way of thinking. Maybe you were gullible but you changed your mind.
They have their back to how you feel, so they don't care how you feel. They don't care that they've made you feel this way. I hope this isn't in a marriage. It could just, this could just be um, meaning making an important decision, like changing your mind about something. Maybe somebody's misled you and kind of misled you and you've realized and now you feel like you've been um, tricked. So you decide to, this can be not keeping it a secret anymore. It's the word behind this card is volcano. So that can be just, yeah, literally letting, letting the truth fly. I really can't tell whether um, this is in like a family situation or a work situation. It could be anywhere, except it, it could be referring to a marriage, but this doesn't just refer to a marriage, but it could refer to a relationship or um, even, a, even a work contract. Wow, Libra, I'm just trying to see if I see anything else in this. But I think that the advice is to make this decision and to communicate it. I think you had something like this last week as well. All right, well, your shuffle song is called Pressure by My Brightest Diamond. I love her. She's awesome. All right, I hope you have a great week. Love you guys. Bye.